I'd like to give a shout out to Todoist for consistently being a good app and for making some updates that really upgrade the experience of this thing. There's a couple different updates that I wanted to talk about that I hadn't gotten to in the last month or so. And just an overall public service announcement for explaining why you probably should try out Todoist. Now, a nice update that they made recently in this section, that is the overdue section on the upcoming view over here, which you can, as you can see, press G and U and go to this page. So if I was on inbox, I could press G and U and it would pop up right here. Instead of having to see all these overdue tasks, what we can do is we can press this right here and it collapses that. So then we can focus on everything else on our task list. A couple of their minor improvements that they've made recently is that they have allowed you to pin reminders on Android, which is really cool. Uh, and then as well as that, they've just made improvements to snoozing different reminders on iOS, as well as I really like this improvement. It changes it from showing you a reminder that you know, you need to get the groceries two minutes ago versus get the groceries and then, you know, like having the actual name of the task there because it's obvious it's Todoist. That was double information, but now we have it so that it shows the name of it and the time rather than this weird, I don't know, there's, there's no need for this. Did anyone need this? I didn't need this. And overall, I just wanted to say for those of you that use other applications like Notion or ClickUp or some of these more project management style applications, I would definitely give Todoist a try. For me personally, I have debated on going into this application full-fledged with my task management system. The only reason that I don't end up using it usually is because of the fact that I like having things hyperlinked within my Notion ecosystem because I make all this content. If I wasn't a content creator and I didn't have to worry about that side of it, I probably wouldn't necessarily be using Notion because the notifications on this, the simplicity of capture, the awesome suite of connectivity that it has to things like Google Calendar. I've made videos before on how to connect this to Google Calendar, which I recommend you check out. And I also have a course on this for just how to get started with the application. One of my best friends, Chance, ended up switching from task management in Notion to Todoist. So this is my bi-monthly public service announcement to check out a task management specific application. Because for those of you that really are struggling with Notion's task management, just know that the free version of this is great. This also has great integrations with my favorite calendar app, Morgan, which you can check out. And I believe that the nice quick capture, just with a, like a quick keybind of alt Q for me or whatever you end up setting it to is just beautiful, quick, easy, and they continuously upgrade this interface. The natural language processing is great and it's something I recommend you check out. And I also recommend you check out this video on how to improve your productivity even more.